Nope. Where's all the water coming from, Dad? But I can balance on the track. Hi everybody, I'm John Keltner, aka The Killer Griller. Uh, got that name because uh, as I'm out uh, grilling for friends and family, uh, they taste the food that I make and they say, man, that tastes killer. So, thus The Killer Griller. Uh, today I'm going to show you a signature dish uh, that I've made. It's uh, Killer Grilled Artichokes. And uh, we'll get started here. We have, we have already... Um, completely trimmed and cooked our artichokes. Um, you cook the artichokes, you boil them for about uh, 45 minutes to 50 minutes um, until they're completely done. So the artichokes are done. In fact, right now you could go ahead and eat them and that's the way a lot of people eat them. But what we're going to do is add a little love to them and uh, really bring in some extra flavor. Uh, what you do is you go ahead and you start by, by splitting your artichokes down the middle and we're going to go ahead and core them. Um, one thing that's very important is that when you trim the artichokes on the bottom, uh, that's very helpful because when you go to cut them, it makes it so that they cut much cleaner and you don't pull any of the uh, any of the leaves out. So let's go ahead and we're going to take the take the choke out, and all we do is give that a quick trim like this. more there and you can see they're all all cleaned out so let's go ahead and get these others done go ahead and top, stop it right there Dad. okay so I've got our artichokes all um, all cleaned out as you can see we're all set they are cored and halved and we're gonna go ahead and uh, I'm gonna turn them over because that's where I'm gonna want to put my marinade to start with so leave that there now what we're going to do is make a little bit of a marinade or a sauce to put over the top of them uh, before we grill them. And the sauce includes um, some seasoned uh, olive oil and then some uh, finely chopped, minced, or pressed garlic. Plenty of garlic in there. It's kind of a can't miss uh, type of thing. Some uh, lemon juice in over the top. And lastly, some soy sauce. And that soy sauce will give it kind of a nice salty, smoky flavor. And then I'm going to put a little bit of salt and pepper in the sauce itself. Okay. Okay, so we've got our sauce put together. And again, that was a olive oil, garlic, soy sauce, and uh, lemon juice in there. And now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and baste our um, artichokes with that on the outside here. Just get a little bit of love on that right over the top. And then let's go ahead and we're going to flip those guys over and we're going to fill the, the little bowl that's been made by our uh, by coring them with this same sauce. Now what's really nice about these is that at this point you could take and refrigerate these and that may even be better because it gives a little more time for the artichokes to um, soak up the, the sauce and to develop a little more flavor. Um, but what's again what's nice about it is you've got a party to go to. These can be made and get all the way to this point and you can refrigerate them and just bring them out to put them on the grill. Okay. So let's go ahead and uh, we're going to put these guys on the grill. And I've got a nice hot grill because realize again that the artichokes are already completely cooked. So all we're doing is basically adding flavor by grilling them. So we're going to want to get a nice hot fire and uh, get, some, get some flame under those bad boys. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and lower this down now. Okay, so we got a, We've got a nice, uh, nice grill going there, and uh, we'll go ahead and cover them up. Total might take five or six minutes, um, but.
but we'll go ahead and cover them up and then we'll turn them in just a little bit. Okay, so these have been cooking for three or four minutes um, on a nice hot grill. Um, before I turn them, I'm going to go ahead and give them a little uh, shake of salt and pepper on this side. Make sure they're nicely seasoned. Okay, and then go ahead and give them a turn. You can see how we've got that nice grilled, nice grilled effect on this side of the artichokes. Very nice, and we will definitely get some flames because of the oil going on this side. Then what we're going to do is take our excess um, sauce that we had on our plate and go ahead and baste this side again. Okay, make sure to get some of that garlic and soy sauce on there. And then salt and season, salt and uh, pepper to taste. Okay, and we will uh, give those guys a couple of minutes on that side. Okay, now while, the, while these are uh, finishing cooking up, uh, I want to show you how to make the dipping sauce. And this is a variation on traditional, obviously people serve uh, artichokes with mayonnaise, um, or uh, melted butter. Um, generally we prefer the mayonnaise uh, dipping sauce. And what we're going to do is we're going to take what we've got left over from our marinade mixture and we're going to go ahead and drop it into our mayonnaise almost completely dropping it okay so now we've added our our uh, olive oil garlic soy sauce mixture to the mayonnaise we'll go ahead and mix that up sort of an aioli type of mixture and that's about the, the darkness that you want of the mayonnaise. If it gets any darker than that, you may have used a little too much soy sauce, which will make it uh, very salty. Okay, and then we're going to go ahead and a little salt and pepper. Get that, uh, get that mixed in. and then we'll go ahead and refrigerate that and uh, so that it kind of solidifies a little bit and we'll be all set. And in a minute we'll take the uh, artichokes off the grill. Okay, our artichokes have been grilling for now between about seven and 10 minutes. Uh, honestly, it doesn't really matter um, how long you grill them. It's really to taste and really to preference because uh, they are already completely cooked uh, when, you, when you've pre-boiled them. So at this point, it's just a matter of how much uh, how much grilled flavor do you uh, do you want to add? So let's go ahead and take a look. They look like they are all set. As you can see, perfect grill marks. Oh, that's going to be delicious. The way I like to serve these is maybe put three of the four down like that, and then just drop one in the middle with it up like that. Then you can put your sauce uh, right in the right in the bowl there and serve it and when you're done with all the rest of them you can dig into this one. If you need more information or want anything else uh, that we do check it out online at www.thekillergriller.com and uh, we appreciate you coming out and we'll see you